Dr. Stephanie Davenport. I am one of the pediatric emergency physicians at CHEO. As parents and as physicians, we know it can be really confusing to know when you need to be seen in the emergency department. So here are a few tips of the things that we need to see in the ED. Firstly, we need to see all infants who are three months of age or younger who have a fever, which is a rectal temperature that is 38 degrees Celsius or higher. We also need to see any child or teenager that is having any kind of difficulty breathing. Difficulty breathing can look like a variety of things, but most important things to look for are using all of the muscles of the body to breathe in and out. Specifically, looking here in the neck that can often get sucked in, using the belly to breathe more aggressively, and looking like they're quite distressed. We need to see any child or teenager that has significant vomiting and diarrhea, who's not able to drink at all, or who has less than three wet diapers or voids in the day, or if any child or teenager has vomiting that has blood in it or diarrhea that has blood in it. In terms of injuries, we see many types of injuries in the emergency department. We often see broken bones and lacerations that might need to be repaired. Anytime your child or teen is not able to walk on their legs because of an injury that they have sustained, that is more concerning for a fracture and we would need to see them in the emergency department. Any large lacerations that are bleeding significantly, we would also need to see those to see if they require any kind of repair. We see many children with head injuries in the emergency department, and the head injuries we are most concerned about are those that involve a loss of consciousness, or after the head injury, the child does not return to their baseline or has significant vomiting. Those are the types of head injuries we would really like to see in the ED. Lastly, any type of burn that is blistering is larger than the size of a loony or is found on the face or the genitals. These are the burns that we really need to see in the emergency department. Ultimately, these are not all the things that we see in the, in the emergency department and you know your child best. So if you have concerns about your child and you feel they need medical care, we are always here for you.